22 and happy Thanksgiving to everybody. Um, I hope you all got in at least 20 minutes of some sort of exercise today. I got out this morning. It was beautiful. It was so beautiful outside. Went for a run and I think this was the best one I've done since I started working out again. Um, it was only 20 minutes, but um, I barely walked at all during it. So I was pretty proud about that. And it wasn't very fast, but it was consistent. So it's good, right? Um, also did 20 push-ups and 20 lunges just to feel like I got my whole body worked out. So um, I had planned on doing that this evening when I got home, but uh, we got home a little later than I expected from JC's family's. So it's 8.30 right now. It's dark. I just ate a little dinner and I'm going to start relaxing so I still feel good about it. It's okay. Now that's a good reason why to get your workout done earlier in the day though because if I would have waited I probably wouldn't have got it in this evening so glad I got it done earlier. Um, my food I did very well. I did exactly as I had thought and I only had one, um, one of the eggs and a piece of the pie. And that's it. My other stuff was turkey and the sweet potato that JC specially made for me and uh, the green beans and I didn't have any of the stuffing or the dressing or um, there was mac and cheese. I didn't have any of that and so I did good. I did good. No alcohol at all whatsoever and um, it was good. Um, now if you have any food left, go throw it away. That's what we're fixing to do. I have, uh, we, there was the pie was a big pan, like one of those big rectangle pans, and there's probably like a little tiny bit taken out from, we probably had three or four pieces total through the whole family that was eaten out of it. The rest of it's going in the trash, because why keep it? I don't know if it's here, then I'll be tempted to eat it, so it's going to get out of here. Um, the turkey's still going to be here, because we can do stuff with that, but everything else, not here anymore. Thanksgiving your food should be over and now you get to start getting back on track for real because here comes the harder holiday which is Christmas. All the baked goods, all the parties, all that kind of stuff's coming up so you really got to stop and plan out what days are you going to um, be kind of letting yourself fall off the wagon a little bit and try not to gain those seven pounds between Thanksgiving and New Year's. Um, while I was over at JC's aunt's house um, his brother's girlfriend said to me, she said, we've been watching your videos and trying to get, you know, inspired to do some stuff. And I was like, well, cool. Is it working? Well, I think we're going to, um, I think we're going to start on January 1st. Amber, didn't you hear me? You gained seven pounds between Thanksgiving and January 1st. So you're not inspired by the videos. That's what everybody does. I'm going to wait till January 1st. And then she tells me, I already have a gym membership. Ah, go get it. Go get do it now. Start tomorrow. Don't wait till January 1st, Amber. Come on. Anyway, um, if you have any questions, call me, though. I'll be happy to help you. But, okay, I'm going to go to bed for tonight, get up and do some Christmas stuff tomorrow, and uh, just start getting ready for the actual holiday season that is here. Um, I'll be working out with Quentin tomorrow at 6.30 in the morning. Make sure I get my second workout in with him this week. So, y'all have a good night. Happy Thanksgiving. Bye-bye.